More evidence tonight of the pressure facing BC's health care system. A new report finds wait times for walk-in clinics here are among the longest in the country. CTV's Shannon Patterson now on the numbers and why some doctors are optimistic they're about to get better. Dr. Yasher Tashakor operates three medical clinics on the North Shore. Two of them accept walk-ins. The walk-in clinic model is a difficult. At any point, you're seeing anywhere between 30 to 50 uh, patients. You have to get to know them very quickly because you don't have a history. While it's not ideal for many patients, it's their only option. A lot of people do not have family doctors. As more British Columbians have been forced to use walk-in clinics, wait times have soared. Medimed a company that tracks walk-in clinic data found BC patients waited an average of 79 minutes to see a doctor last year, up from 68 minutes in 2021 and 43 minutes in 2020. Wait times in BC are, are bad and they've been getting worse. Um, you know, one of the things that we're noticing is, frankly, there's fewer doctors going into family medicine and there's a lot of walk-in clinics that we're hearing actually anecdotally that are closing their doors. North Vancouver had the longest wait times in all of Canada at 160 minutes, followed by Victoria at 137 minutes. Rounding out BC's top five, Vancouver, Burnaby and Langley, all at an hour plus, well above the national average of 37 minutes. These statistics reflect a, a system that we knew had a problem, part of it being shortage of physicians. You would think a place like Vancouver could recruit pretty well, but no, um, you know, when we talk to some of the larger clinics and health authorities in BC, you know, that's their number one priority is doctor recruiting. Dr. Tashakor is optimistic a new fee structure for family doctors that came into effect February 1st will relieve some of the pressure on walk-in clinics. The incentive will be there for more physicians to decide to practice family medicine and the incentive will be there for more physicians to take on new patients and so there will be less need for patients having to go to a walk-in clinic. He's opening his fourth medical clinic this spring. While it will offer walk-in, he's hoping by then there will be more family doctors and fewer patients will need it. Shannon Patterson, CTV News, North Vancouver.